Hello, what is up guys? I'm your host Gordon and welcome to finally another Foam Dive Blaster Armory 2.0 building video. Today we got lots of stuff to install. We got lightings, we got LED strips and finally we managed to get ourselves some IKEA pegboard. Of course not the pegboard for the Epic Blaster War but at least we should be able to get the workshop section done by today. So there is a lot of wiring, there's a lot of likes, so wish me luck and without further ado, let us go build some Nerf Armory. First, let us start off by attaching the LED strips on the pre-routed wire. Next, we are going to connect the fish eye light to the pre-routed wire at the middle part of the display cabinet and finish off the fish eye light installation. Next, we are going to peel off the adhesive backing of the LED strip and start sticking them into the pre-installed railing on the cabinet. And then put in the LED diffusion cover. Next, we are going to do the same thing with the IKEA SCADIS pegboard by sticking these RGB LED strips at the back of the pegboard. After doing so, we are going to install the pegboard on the wall. Next, we are going to install a top-down light for our workshop. It is just as simple as screwing it at the top of the cabinet and plugging it into the power point. But first, let us test the light and see if it works. Oh yeah, it works! Last but not least, we are going to connect all the wire to the LED driver so that it can provide power for the LEDs in the cabinet. And now for the moment of truth! Yes! 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 Yes, yes. Alright, so the table light is done, the cabinet lights are done. I mean, take a look at this. Oh my god, it looks so good. Okay, now for the RGB pegboard, the moment of truth. Yeah, we did it! And one more thing, check this out, guys. Holy moly, it looks so epic! Oh my god, it looks so beautiful! I mean, man, that table do need some cleanup! So basically, this is like the prettier part of the entire room. But when we actually turn to this side, oh my god, everything is very messy. Yes, I'm still using this chair right now. I mean, oh my god, that hole is getting bigger. I mean, what on earth are these? I mean, seriously, this kind of chair, I mean, this is a DX racer though. I reupholstered it before. It is an expensive chair. You know, getting a new one can be quite pricey. I mean, to whatever company who wanted to hook me up with something like that, or wanted to, you know, upholster this chair, you know, ring me up anytime. The good news is we actually got a pretty good price for our tabletop over here. It is actually on its way. So we are going to get a very good table over here for our computer setup because this is where I edit all the videos. Right on top of the computer, there is still no updates yet. The pegboard is still on its way. Right over this side, yes, the pegboard is not up yet. Hopefully the next video is all about the pegboard because that is probably going to be the most epic thing to do. Right over here at the door, the blaster over here are still the same. There is no adjustment yet. We have a couple of Gundam boxes over here because GBWC is here. I'm participating. And yep, I guess that's it guys. Oh my god, this part looks so nice. I mean, compared to this side. And take a look at this guys. I mean, holy moly. Yes, there is still a little bit of cleaning that I need to do with the glasses over there. But I mean, take a look at those LEDs. This is so nice. Uh, For now, I took down all the blaster in the cabinet and put in two 1 over 100 Gundam in there just for scale. For temporary measure, I put all the Mac Potato Blaster over here. So the plan is to have all the Gundam model kits on the top compartment and all the blaster on the bottom compartment. Over the middle over here, this is going to be for my perfect great Gunpla display or some sort of a huge resin statue. On the right hand side, it is going to be similar with the left as well. Overall, I would say that I am very happy with the build. Everything looks so neat and it looks so clean. So yep, that's all today guys. Like this video for the YouTube algorithm. Subscribe if you haven't already. And of course, I'm going to see you in the next video. Adios guys!